my name is Andy Parry, I'm a senior lecturer in critical care at the University of South Wales. I'm going to show you correct bag mask technique. Once you've established that your patient needs their airway maintained, the two pieces of equipment you need is a self-inflating bag or an ambi bag and a mask. It's very important to correctly fit this mask for the patient. Um, you place the apex of the mask on the patient's nose, making sure that the bottom of the mask doesn't overhang the chin and also making sure that the mask covers, of course, the mouth and the nose. Attach your arm back. The easiest way to maintain an airway is to use your first finger and your middle finger. Place these at the angle of the jaw, like so, it's just below the ear, and use the heel of your hand on the hard part of the mask on both sides. What, what you're effectively doing is using these two fingers to pull the jaw upwards, helps tilt the head back and you're using the heels of your hands to push the mask down to create a seal on the mask. So you use both hands to maintain this airway and then of course you would provide a breath just enough to ensure a chest rise. These bags can be used without an oxygen supply, but if you're near an oxygen supply, it's a good idea to connect it up and put a 15 litre flow of 100% oxygen through there.